Today we are visiting the building behind us called Venin Court. It's a city-owned building which is invaded and there's a lot of um, criminal activities that um, the Jobek East class they've been complaining about to say people are robbed in this area and they will run into this building. So being a, a city-owned building, we found it necessary as the city to ensure that we understand as to how many people are staying in these buildings. You know, the profile in terms of the adults, whether they are working, how much they earn. So we really gather, we want to gather the data of the number of people that are staying in this building. And from then on, we'll be able to understand or to decide as to what we do as the city going forward to ensure that the building is actually managed properly as the city. We are here with SAPS, the Johannesburg um, East Cluster, that is doing crime prevention. I am of an understanding that as we were busy assisting the social development in, <coughs> inside the building to do the profiling of the, the occupiers, um, there is someone who has been arrested by Home Affairs, because Home Affairs is also here, for being undocumented. And um, obviously the process in terms of their Immigration Act would actually um, be applicable to deal with the matter going forward. Because this is a multidisciplinary intervention, our JMPD officials also saw it prudent that as we're busy inside, you know, with the, with the, with the social development doing the, the profiling of the occupiers, they would do their bylaw you know, enforcement to actually inspect the shops around this area. Because what normally happens is that when the subs do an application to get the search warrant, they normally will request a search warrant for the block. So there's nothing that prevents them to go beyond the building behind us. We could actually go to any other building within the block which they've applied or within which the Section 13.7 warrant has been approved for. Hence they had to go, the, the JNPD are using this opportunity as well to go through the, the to go into these um, shops to actually <clears throat> inspect and check whether the occupiers or the owners of the shops are in compliance with the city of Joburg. Um, bylaws and the applicable legislation. Normally, this kind of operations um, they do, you know, um, bear better, you know, outcome as opposed to the city doing its interventions on its own. <laughs>